I mean, this is just one of the coolest events that exists in, in motorsports. It's a lot of fun, you know, a lot of guys treat this as, it's an exhibition race. There's nothing on the line but bragging rights and you've got some of the best drivers in the world, in history in, in some cases, uh, all out here just fighting for glory, man. It's a lot of fun. The Rock Buggy is kind of known as the, as the hot ticket here and it's uh, such a unique thing. I mean, I've wanted to drive the aerial Adam for a long time, but the Rock Buggy is the one that I'm most looking forward to. I mean, the problem is, because there are so many IndyCar drivers representing the sport here, more than any other series, if one of us don't win, if IndyCar doesn't bring it home, it's, it's not going to look great. Uh, if I don't win this, then I will challenge some of my competitors to a dancing contest just so I can feel better about myself. Driving different cars, you know, uh, some of them are easier than the others, so uh, we're having a chance to test. I uh, hop in with Hinch a couple times. Um, but really, it's a, it's a fun event. We have seven IndyCar drivers on, a, on an event this big, which you call Race of Champions. So that means we, we're, we're very well represented. It's a big party, right? And it's a big event. So obviously, I've known Felipe forever. But you know, that though, you know, Montoya is here, uh, David Coulter, Jensen Button, all these big names as well that we don't get to see each other much during the year, never, let alone racing against each other. So it's fun. Well, I haven't driven all of them so far, so uh, I would say the least fun is the three-wheeler and uh, probably the most fun is the, that, uh, what's the name of that car, I don't know, the, bu the buggy, whatever, That's, that thing is fast.